first thing I want you to notice about the gut here is that it is linked right here to the blood vessel factors in hormonal factors. And we're going to talk about both of those things today and how, the, how this is linked and also sexual vitality. Okay, we're going to talk big into that. And we're also going to talk about how the gut, if you follow this line across, affects performance anxiety. This is um, something that most guys don't think about. Okay, but we're going to talk about how it affects performance anxiety today as well. And we, I've talked about this before, but I'm going to go deeper today because uh, I think it's a really good place to start in terms of understanding the importance of the gut. And that is leaky gut. So we're going to start with leaky gut here. And this is looking at the inside of your gut. And as you can see, the inside of your gut is filled with these endothelial cells. This is the endothelial cells, also known as the endothelium. And all of these endothelial cells should be held close together, tight together. This normal tight junction is what it says here, right? But what happens is when the gut gets inflamed for a variety of reasons, usually just crappy food that we're eating, or you know maybe we're overdoing antibiotics or whatever it is, medications, we're taking ED drugs. ED drugs are huge here, make a lot of inflammation in your gut. What ends up happening is these break apart. These tight junctions break apart, and it makes it open so that bad stuff can get through. Okay, like food particles, viruses, bacteria, all that stuff. And what we're going to, uh, the reason that's important is that once that gets through and into your bloodstream, okay, your, it does a couple of things. One of which is that your body sees that as a foreign invader. So it ramps up the, um, uh, the uh, immune system, right? It's got to, because it's got to take care of that stuff. Right? But the problem is, is once your immune system is ramped up, your reproductive system gets deprioritized. Okay? Because your body's number one function is keeping you alive. Okay? Nothing else matters unless you're alive. Okay? So that's its number one function. Its second function, fortunately for, for us, because we're talking about sexual performance, is reproduction, right? So that's the second thing it wants to focus on. But first, it's got to keep you alive. So when that immune system jacks up, your body sees that you're in danger, it deprioritizes your reproductive system. So basically, it makes it much more difficult to get erections, maintain erections, it lowers your libido, and it significantly lowers your testosterone levels. When this happens, when this leaky gut happens, which causes the triggering of the immune system. 60%, at least 60% of your immune system is right around your gut because of this fact, by the fact that you're very susceptible in your gut for you know, bad stuff to get into your bloodstream. Okay, so that's number one. When you have leaky gut like this, it's going to deprioritize your reproductive system because of the immune system and tank your testosterone levels. But here's the other thing. This endothelium also takes place in the blood vessels, right? So same thing. Look, endothelial cell, okay? Endothelial cell. And they are held together with a tight junction, just like your gut, just like this. It's a mirror of the same thing. But, well, I'll talk about in a second why this is so important, but when this stuff leaks out and, inf and gets into your blood vessels, it causes inflammation in the blood vessel itself. Okay, There's other things that will cause inflammation in the blood vessel, but this is a big one, leaky gut that most guys don't think about. Right, It gets into your gut, inflames it, and once it's inflamed, okay, it breaks apart these tight junctions. See? Breaks them apart, just like in the gut breaks them apart. And once that happens, you can see here that it narrows the uh, passageway here. So less blood flow can get through, right? It makes it more difficult for blood to get through, which not only means, you know, less 
uh, red blood cells can get through at a time, but also it increases the blood pressure in your body, okay, because you have less of a space. So anytime you narrow that space and your heart has to push through it, it's going to increase your blood pressure. So this increases your blood pressure. And not only that, once this happens, and once again, I'm tying it back to the gut, right? This is what caused it in the first place. Came through the leaky gut into the uh, blood vessel, which inflamed the blood vessel, which caused the endothelial cells to uh, break apart here at these tight junctions. Okay. Once that happens, you got what's called endothelial dysfunction. If you would like help with your unique and personal situation from us, I put a link below that will explain all the different ways that we can help you get and maintain superior stage four rock solid hardness and lasting power both permanently and naturally at any age. Make sure you like and subscribe for more tips to attain elite level bedroom performance and I will see you in the next one.